In this screencast video, I'm going to talk about how to write a literary analysis essay. In this, uh, in this particular Sam student sample, uh, the student writes about a, an Indian story known as Ramayana. So here you have the MLA style heading where you have to put your name, professor's name, the literature the, of the name of the class, and also don't forget to put your last name and your page number and to center your uh, title. And you have double, double space. Now, as you know, the thesis statement, which is the main idea of your essay, always has to be the last sentence of the first paragraph. In your first paragraph, you start out with something general. You start out with a hook that grabs the reader's attention, and then you write five sentences about your topic that leads to your thesis statement. And so here, the thesis statement is the last sentence of the first paragraph. And so I'll read it out to you. It's duty, loyalty, and devotion are the lessons taught in Ramayana to help open the minds of Indian youth to the lessons of Dharma and Karma and how to behave in Indian society. And so this this student wrote about that the main values of uh, main themes found in Ramayana are duty, loyalty, and devotion. So those are the main themes of this particular particular literary story. So that the first um, sentence, the first the first paragraph, talks about duty. The second paragraph talks about loyalty. Third paragraph talks about devotion. So as you can see, um, he has, this particular student, has a thesis statement that has matching body paragraphs, duty, loyalty, and devotion. And so you have here uh, duty, the first paragraph, loyalty, the second paragraph, and devotion as the third paragraph. Then within each body paragraph, you can then have your direct quote, use pie structure, where you have the first sentence is the P, main point. Then you have your I, in-text citations, which he uses, uh, in this case, he uses a definition from Webster, Merriam, um, dictionary, and then E, an explanation of that in-text citation in your own words. All right, And so you would use a thesis statement to recap. In a literature paper, you use a thesis statement as the last sentence of the first paragraph, and then each of the body paragraphs, second paragraph would be about duty, this, the third paragraph would be about loyalty. Fourth paragraph would be about devotion, so that the thesis would have matching body paragraphs. Each body paragraph would follow pi structure, in which you have the first sentence, the main point, is the main idea from the thesis. Then you have an in-text citation, uh, which, which is a direct quote, or it could be a paraphrase quote, of less than 40 words. That would be I, and an E, explanation of that in-text citation in your own words. And then don't forget that in your last, in the conclusion paragraph, to repeat the thesis statement as the first sentence of the last paragraph. And that's all it takes to write a literature, at least a structure, uh, paragraph and essay structure. So this is a video on the literature essay structure of a literary analysis. In my next video, I will talk about the different kinds of literary analysis that you can write. So this particular, uh, to recap, this particular literary analysis deals with thematics. What, is, what are the main themes in Ramayana? And so the main themes are duty, loyalty, and devotion. 
Um, and so this ends my video on how to write a thematic literary analysis using five paragraph essay structure.